Hi, I'm Anthony, Executive Chef at the Ned, and today we're going to be making yellowtail tuna crudo. Um, you could use uh, normal tuna, you could use cod, or you could use sea bass or stone bass for this. Uh, we're also going to be serving it with a uh, yuzu and soy dressing, uh, yuzu truffle and soy dressing. Um, and then we've got some chilli, some spring onions, and some hijaki here, which we'll talk about in a minute. First of all, we need to prepare the fish. Um, so your fishmonger should do this for you, but just in case they don't, you're gonna get a nice loin like this. So all we're gonna do is trim it up just a piece. Slide just a little bit. We're gonna take the bloodline off here. Where the meat's really dark, just trim some of that back. And then we'll whip the skin off. Keep the blade nice and tight, just angled down, if you can see that there, just angled down against the skin, so that we're not cutting off any fish and we're getting nice, clean. Nice, clean skin there when we've got. And then we want to cut this into just about 70 gram portions. We'll trim that end piece off there. just to bash it out we're going to bash it out a little bit because um, you know raw fish can be have quite a sort of gelatinous mouth feel so what we want to do is just flatten it down a little bit it's going to make it easier to eat it's going to take on uh, a bit more of the dressing just pop it in between there we've got a meat tenderizer here but you could use the bottom of a pan um, You can use any sort of flat instrument for this really. I'm using a knife, but you could use a spoon or a in like that. I'm gonna make a nice round shape. So next onto the dressing, it's a really simple dressing. So we've got our yuzu juice here. We'll put the recipe in the link below. We've got yuzu juice, soy sauce, truffle oil, sushi seasoning, and brown sugar. Okay, so really super simple. All we're gonna do, add everything to the blender. sit for probably about half an hour because as you can see it's gone quite a light creamy sort of color 
where the air's been cut into the dressing. Um, once it settles, you'll have like a, a little bit of colour underneath and you've still got that white film on the top. So um, normally you would leave that for about half an hour. Uh, what we've got here are some, some little baby herbs. We've got coriander and shiso. You could use normal sized coriander, chives, um, dill would go quite well with this. We've got some chili that we've just cut in half, de-seeded, shredded nice and thin. Some spring onions, again, which we've cut really nice and thin. And then we've got hijaki. This is a type of seaweed. It's got a wonderful flavor to it. Uh, what we do, it comes dried. You can order it from Amazon. Um, and what we do is we rehydrate it with a few ingredients, which we'll put in the recipe below. Uh, and that's it, super, super simple. So, actually, what we do is we take our dressing, spoon that over the top, and this is a really acidic dressing. So the idea is that this is gonna slightly cook the fish, very similar to ceviche or tartare. And then we have some chili over the top. Some spring onion, just scatter them over the top. You want to make sure that it's covered quite evenly, but you don't need to be too precise. And then some of the hijaki. This stuff is absolutely great. It really looks fantastic on the plate as well. And then just some picked herbs over the top. Okay, so that is our yellowtail crudo with yuzu, truffle dressing, chili, spring onion, and picked herbs.